Hello, this is a virtual microscopy slide showing a case of a meningioma and this particular type is the commonest histologic variant which is the meningothelial meningioma. Over in this right lower aspect of the slide we can see that there is some fibrous dura mater attached to the tumour and this is composed of very dense pink collagen fibres. The tumour itself is composed of sheets of polygonal cells with relatively uniform oval nuclei. We can see the individual nuclei that are quite similar in size and shape. And if I were to pick a nucleus and draw a line around the outline, we can see that the nuclear membranes are generally very smooth. Going back to lower magnification, we also get the feeling that there are some kind of rounded arrangements of cells. And let's zoom in on these. So these somewhat whirly structures are known as meningothelial whorls. And we can see some nice examples here and here and also here. And here is another feature to highlight in a meningioma. This is a nucleus, but within the nucleus, there is a little island of cytoplasm, which is pink and appears the same as the cytoplasm of the cell. This is a nuclear pseudo-inclusion, which is an infolding of the nuclear membrane. And this is also a feature that is quite frequently seen in meningioma. And moving around, there is another feature here. And this is a calcification. If you look closely, you can see that there are some concentric rings. So this is a samoma body. And samoma bodies can also sometimes be seen in meningiomas. So this is an example of a meningothelial meningioma. This particular tumour is usually a low-grade tumour and we use the World Health Organization WHO grading system. It's usually grade 1. There are some features that would make us worry about a higher grade and these always have to be looked for in meningiomas and they include things like the presence of tumour necrosis, invasion into the brain if there is any brain tissue also excised, presence of increased mitotic figures, very prominent nucleoli, which we do not see here, and also the presence of small cells with high NC ratios, again, something that we don't see here. Therefore, there are no high-grade or worrying features in this particular tumour. So, in summary, this is a meningothelial meningioma with sheets of polygonal uniform cells with oval nuclei, with meningothelial walls, with occasional intranuclear pseudo-inclusions, and another nice example can be seen here, and also occasional samometers calcifications. Thank you.